Many governments are thinking about changing laws to provide better security against TikTok. Some say China uses this social media app to shape public opinions. They argue the Chinese government is collecting personal information, especially on devices in the public sector. Taiwan's government has listed Douyin, the Chinese version of TikTok, as a product that could potentially endanger the country's information security. U.S. officials have also warned about data collections on users recently. The No TikTok on Government Devices Act is waiting for approval from the U.S. House to stop people from using the app on government devices. Opponents argue that the app collects search and browsing history, uh, potentially including keystroke patterns. There are also concerns about allegations that the app collects biometric patterns, including face and voice print. These can be used to track activists and organize foreign influence campaigns. This is a major concern, knowing that the two main operating systems on the market, iOS and Android, both made in the US, supposedly protect users' privacy. Earlier this year, the Pegasus spyware was used to hack into government officials and activist phones worldwide. The Cambridge Analytica scandal in 2018 also showed that personal information can be used to shape public opinions during elections. Well, should we accept that social media platforms collect our personal information? In 2019, Taiwan passed the anti-infiltration law to address the growing influence of China in Taiwan politics and the democratic process. Now, it is maybe the time to limit the amount of information apps like TikTok can collect and other social media platforms. Dimitri Goyas, TVBS World Taiwan.